It's been a fantastic experience from the beginning all the way to our finished project here. Um, it's been incredibly interactive. The skills that the students are learning as far as computer programming, cooperation, they've worked very hard together. They had to work in uh, groups um, in order to uh, research their information, in order to put this together. There was a whole lot of problem solving that was involved in this, trying to figure out um, how to make certain things work, trying to figure out how to design the uh, 3D representations of the buildings. Um, it's been in, an, an amazing uh, experience for the kids. And um, something as a general classroom teacher, uh, I found this incredibly useful uh, because of all the expertise that comes uh, with the, the program. It's been great. Awesome. Can you tell us about the, some of the different subjects that were woven oh. together to make yes. this? Yes. Um, okay, so this is definitely a cross-curricular kind of an activity. Um, for this one, this was the grade six um, energy unit. So we were looking at the power supply for Ontario. Uh, the students also needed to use mathematics, number sense, figuring out percentages of power, ratios, things like that. Um, language arts was also incorporated into this because they were uh, researching, so using researching skills as well as writing out information that they had found out about the different types of power sources. Um, I think that's pretty much the three Great. big strands that were involved. I mean, awesome. and learning skills for sure, cooperation, um, working together, uh, their, um, I'm blanking. Sorry. <laughs> That's all right. Can <laughs> yeah. I ask you one, one last question? Yeah. Just how, how engaged were they in, uh, in doing this activity? The students were incredibly engaged. Like every Friday morning when I said, okay, time to go into the gathering room. We're doing, the, uh, they're doing our workshop today. They were in as fast as they could be. They were sitting down. They were ready to go. Um, throughout the activity, they were incredibly engaged, whether they were doing their computer programming or uh, putting together the model. And what was really nice is that kids could also build on skills that, that they had or skills that they wanted to develop more. So if a student wanted to learn about, um, there was lots of choice. So if a student wanted to learn about computer programming more, they could be in part of that group. If a kid wanted to learn more about how a motor works and how um, electricity works to make that motor run, they could be in that group. If they really wanted to do some more of the research stuff, they could do that as well. So it was very engaging.